This is lesson module five, four, lesson five, homework on the back. Number two, Allie makes a rectangle with 45 square inch tiles. She arranges the tiles in five equal rows. How many square inch tiles are in each row? Use words, pictures, and numbers to support your answer. So important information that I need to circle. She's using 45 square inch tiles and she's putting them into five equal rows. I need to figure out how many square inch tiles are in each row. So to start, I know that I have the number 45 as my total. This is very similar to the front of your paper. You just don't have a picture to help you on the back. She's putting them into five equal rows. I want to know how many are in those equal rows. So in my picture, I have a rectangle and I'm gonna demonstrate just one row. Those are my five equal rows. I need to figure out what my measurement is on the bottom. I know the side is five inches because there are five tiles showing. So I can skip count by fives until I get to 45 to find my answer. Five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45. That gives me a total of nine. So my second measurement would be nine inches. Using words, there are nine tiles in each row. Number three, Leon makes a rectangle with 36 square centimeter tiles. There are four equal rows of tiles. How many tiles are in each row? Use words, pictures, and numbers to support your answer. Just like number two, we, this time we have a total of 36 square centimeter tiles and we have four equal rows, we still have to find how many there are in each row. I have a total of 36 tiles. There are four equal rows. I need to find how many are in each row. I have my rectangle. Here is the demonstration of the rows. I know that I have four tiles in each row, giving me four centimeters. I'm going to count by fours until I get to 36. Four, eight, 12, 16, 20, 24, 28, 32, 36. That gives me nine. There, are nine, again, as same as number two, tiles in each row. Letter B. Can Leon arrange all of his 36 square centimeter tiles into six equal rows? Use words, pictures, and numbers to support your answer. I want to use still 36 tiles, but this time I want to arrange them into six equal rows, and I want to see if that is possible. So I'm going to, again, draw my rectangle, and this time I'm going to demonstrate six in one row. I want to know, can I keep only 36 and keep going? So this time I'm gonna make a second row of six 
and I'm going to label 6, 12, 18, 24, 30, so there's 30 tiles. Let me make another row. 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36. Is it possible to arrange 36 tiles into rows of six? You need to use your words to answer the rest of that question before moving on to letter C. Do the rectangles in part A and B have the same total area? Explain how you know. If we look at A, our area in A was 36 square centimeters. Our area in B was 36 square centimeters. On your own, think about if those rectangles in part A and B have the same area and explain with words how you know. 